Is Ruby here yet? Just a few more seconds. Are you excited to meet your future stepsister? Oh, we both are. Now Harley has someone new to hang out with at school. Other than Claire and Brooke. They're my friend's mom. Mm-hmm. <gasps> Ruby, it's so good to see you. I've missed you so much. I miss you too, Dad. <laughs> hey. Hey, I'm uh, Her name is Harley, and she was just leaving to go do homework. No, I wasn't. I Bedroom, to... now. Let me take that for you. You're gonna be staying in Harley's room. Come on in. Oh, actually, I, uh, your father and I need to take care of something first. It's, um... It's the kitchen. It's a mess. So why don't you just wait here? Hmm? <laughs> no, she doesn't care if the dishes are dirty, do you? Mm -mm. Just wait on the couch for a second. Come on in. It's so great to finally have you here. <laughs> we'll be right back. Just stay here. Please. Something wrong? Everything's wrong, Hank. Do I have to spell it out for you? Did you see how she was dressed? Oh, that's just the way some kids dress these days. There's nothing to worry about. That's disgusting. It's how druggies dress. <laughs> and why did you allow her to get all those piercings? Well, in case you forgot, I haven't seen her for a little while. She didn't have those before. Tattoos? I know. I'm not particularly happy with those, but... She's 18 now. She can make her own decisions. Do you really think that my sweet Harley should be hanging out with someone like that? What if Harley turns out to be like your daughter? There is nothing wrong with Ruby. She may look a little different, but that doesn't make her a bad person. I should know. I raised her most of her life. People change. And sometimes for the worse. Ruby has been going through some hard times with her mom lately. That might be why she has this new look. Either way, we promised that she could live with us until at least after she graduated. That was before I knew what she was like. Okay, do me a favor. Don't judge a book by its cover. I know, right? Harley. I love this one. It's like my Harley? favorite. Harley. I told you to do your homework. I'll do it later. I want to hang out with Ruby. No. You know how bad your grades have been. You need to do it right now. Sorry. Um, I'm going to go outside real quick to take this. Funny she couldn't take the call in here. I wonder what she's hiding. Harley? What did Ruby talk to you about? I was just asking her if she played Roblox. Can we play before dinner? Absolutely not. Homework first, always. Harley, I know that Ruby may seem nice. But there is a lot to her that you don't know or understand. She may be doing very bad. You okay? I don't really know how to put this, but I can't go back home to mom anymore. Why? What happened? I don't really want to talk about it, but I have no idea where I'm going to go when summer starts. It's okay. You're just gonna stay here for as long as you need, all right? Thanks, Dad. Thank you, too, Lisa. <laughs> okay, well, let me just show you where you're gonna be staying. Oh, I wanna come, too.
got a D again. My mom's gonna kill me. How? Algebra's so easy. I got an A on that test. I just don't understand it. Maybe you can help me after school? Can't. Claire and I are going to the mall to shop for homecoming dresses. Wait, have you asked Jonah to go with you yet? No, I'm too nervous to do that. Ew. Who is the new girl? What is she wearing? She looks like she walked right out of a mosh pit. Yeah. Or the kind of girl to smoke cigarettes behind a dumpster. She looks like she smells. Hey, um, don't be mean. What? Don't tell us you think she's cool. I didn't say that. Hey, Harley. Oh my god, do you know her? Uh, no, we... We bumped into each other in the parking lot. Okay. She didn't talk to weirdos like her. How was school today? It was all right. Oh, wait, wait. What about Ruby? What about her? Aren't you taking her home too? No, she can find her own way. Uh, but she's. Listen to me. Ruby is not a good influence on you. I want you staying away from her. Got me? How am I supposed to do that when she's living with us? Yeah, not for long. We can I need to have a talk about that. Hey! Ruby, where have you been? You didn't answer your phone. Yeah, sorry. We waited for so long, but we ended up leaving. Ruby! Just leave her. Did you see how red her eyes were? She's probably on something. It looked to me like she had been crying. Emotionally unstable. Just another bad sign. It's probably why her mom kicked her out. Ruby did not get kicked then out. Why else can she not go back home, Hey. I don't know. But I'm sure as soon as she's ready, she will tell me. And in the meantime, I'm not going to assume anything. Well, I want her sleeping on the couch, not in Harley's room, until we find a more permanent solution. Which, by the way, we need to speak about. And soon. I gotta see what's going on. Eat your food. Eat it. We were worried. I don't think Lisa would have left me to walk home if she was so worried. She said that she waited for a very long time. I saw her drive off. She hates me, Dad. Please stop. This is just an adjustment period for all of us, okay? It's not gonna last forever. Especially once Lisa gets to know the real you. That sweet girl underneath all of the tattoos, piercings. Packing up already? I think that makes sense. Your father can take you wherever you need to go. Just an adjustment period? I'll talk to her. Just please don't leave. Where would you even go? I don't know, Dad. But I'd rather be homeless than stay here another night. Just give it a couple of days, OK? If nothing improves, then, then you can leave. I won't even try to stop you. You guys won't believe this. The creep is now in my PE class. The goth girl? Mm-hmm. Ew. Did she try talking to you and Harley? Harley! Huh? Why?
Why don't you just ask him already? Brooke's right. There's not much time left. I'm scared he's gonna say no. Well, there's only one way to find out. Claire, no! Where are you? Just let her do this. It's for your own good. Oh my god, Isabel, I'm so sorry. You got spaghetti all over me. It was an accident. I really didn't mean Meet to. Meet me after school. You're gonna pay for this? Stop worrying. She's not even gonna do anything. Yeah, she's just all talk. <gasps> there she is. Come on, let's go. I think we lost her. Isabel, please. Thought you could run away from me, eh? That's strike two. Hold on, think about it. Even if you do want to fight me, it's three against one. You'll be outnumbered. Sorry, Harley. You're on your own. Let's go. Guess your friends aren't gonna save you now. This is what happens. Hey! Why don't you pick on someone your own size? Yeah, that's what I thought. Are you okay? Yeah. Wow. Thanks so much for helping me. You're welcome. <laughs> I almost got him. We get it. Where have you been? I waited in the parking lot for over an hour for you. Sorry, I just walked home with Ruby. Why walk, Ruby? What are you trying to hide? Hmm? Nothing. It was Harley's idea. I... Right, as if you didn't try to convince her. You know, Ruby, I knew you would be a terrible influence on her. It was bad enough you were hanging out with Claire and Brooke. But you're even worse. No, she's not. You stay out of this, Harley. Clearly, she's brainwashed you. Coming home, playing games instead of doing your homework, which you should be doing. It's no wonder you're failing algebra. And Ruby, what's next? Huh? You're going to teach her how to do drugs? You have it all wrong. Yeah, right. Why else would you look like that? It's probably why your own mother kicked you out. Yeah, that's right. Pack your suitcase. I hope you really leave this time. Sure. I'll go. But for your information, my mom didn't ask me to leave. She's the one that left. What are you talking about, Ruby? A couple years ago, my mom slipped at work. She ended up getting hurt, so a doctor prescribed her some painkillers. After a while, the pain went away, but she never stopped taking the drugs. And our lives completely changed. She lost a lot of weight. She quit her job. She wouldn't even leave the house for weeks. Those pills ruined our life. And I never told my dad because I, I didn't want him to worry. Where did she go? rehab. I'm glad she's finally getting help, but we lost our apartment. That's why I came to stay here. If I knew it was going to cause so many problems, I never would have come. I know I get judged a lot because of how I look, but the one thing I will not tolerate is being accused of doing drugs. Because I've seen firsthand what it can do to someone. So I would never... I'm sorry about your mother. I am. But my priority is with Harley. Her grades are already slipping, and I come home... Ruby already helped me finish my homework. That's the first thing we did when we got home. Turns out... Ruby's an advanced calculus. She's a math whiz. She promised a tutor me to help me get better. 
I know I may not look the part, but I actually got a 4.3 GPA last semester. Wow. And unlike what you said earlier, Ruby's a way better friend than Claire and Brooke. I almost got in a fight today at school, and both of them ditched me. What do you mean you almost got into a fight? It wasn't my choice, but if it wasn't for Ruby, I probably would have gotten my butt kicked. You won't have to worry about Isabel while I'm around. Yes. What's wrong? I just realized. I should never judge a book by its cover. Oh. You know. Oh. Hi, Jonah. Harley will be out in a few minutes. For once, I am glad that you are making somebody wait outside. <laughs> I can't believe she already has a date. She's too young. How did this happen? <laughs> um, I may or may not have had something to do with that. But, I mean, for what it's worth, he seems nice. Mm -hmm. So you are influencing Harley. Maybe that's not such a bad thing. I've never seen Harley get an A on an algebra test before. Oh, honey, you look incredible. <laughs> Is that a nose piercing? Harley. Oh, yeah, um, Ruby took me to get it. I hope that's OK. Ruby, I cannot believe you. Now you've crossed the line. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. <laughs> it's magnetic. See? <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> Did you make Jonah wait outside? Yeah. What's the rush? Maybe you don't even have to go at all? Oh, come on. Have a good time, honey. Hey. Bye. You're great. Thank you. Bye, guys. Back to me and waiting. <laughs> Are you in a rock and roll at all? 